Franny. Doesn't stop us. Hi there, welcome to the Beaten Trail. In this episode, we take a ride up to Potter County, Pennsylvania for the Maple Syrup Run, organized by the Potter County ATV UTV Club. Miguel was nice enough to offer to take me and the Honda up to save a little fuel. About a three hour drive up to Gary's family's cabin, where we would stay for a few nights. Long time no see. I'm good, man. How you been? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, six liters. A little tra trail. Yeah, that'll stop blinding you. Carrying logs long enough. Oh, I'm a. Uh, we didn't even get half the truck done yet. Yeah. Uh, no, no safe trip. Yeah. Yep. Fun. Glad Congrats. everybody made it. Good memories. The Beaten Trail is sponsored by Ride Royal Blue ATV Resort in Pioneer, Tennessee, where all of your Tennessee adventures begin. Lodging for any budget, bring your RV, or stay in a cabin. Trails are attached to the resort and not a far drive on ATV legal pavement. So stop down at Ride Royal Blue in Tennessee. And this is the uh, party room in here? Oh, the party room. <laughs> party room. That's right. The kitchen. Be afraid to fall asleep. Yeah, this morning I went to go look for my room. I can make my own pillow, please. Yeah. That works. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the room this morning. As you can see, it's a beautiful day out here. And we mushy and sloshy enough? It's definitely a little wet today. A little moist. Moist. Yeah, I know, I saw that. Well, here we are, Saturday morning for the Maple Run. A little bit of wet today. We're going to get out of the mud and everything here. Fire is smoldered from last night. We're ready to go. Just got to load more stuff in the truck. A little bit of snow starting. We'll see you over at the event. Good. Just a little muddy. I'm sure how much how much rain we got. So we're on our way to the maple syrup run. Beautiful day, huh, Miguel? Uh -huh. Looks like uh, we got 34 degrees, mixed mixed uh, snow rain. Should be a wonderful day to go get some maple syrup. Only about 30 minutes from our cabin location, we headed to our destination where the run would begin, and the Potter County group made sure there was plenty of parking, a nice big parking lot for all our trailers. Potter County. How are you? We made it. Yep. What's that? Yep. yep. Someone will have to sign Paul in. To make sure because. Here, right? Yes, we yeah, right. we okay. end up. Yep. We got everything unloaded for a long day, and it was then time for the driver's meeting. A couple of rules. Please turn your headlights on. Light bars off. Um, we don't want to get stopped for light bars. State police, you know. Um, if you get to a turn, you can't see the guy behind you. Wait until you can see the people behind you. We don't want to leave anybody behind. Uh, everything is going to be a little moist today. Front and rear cameras, 360. So we're going to do a little bit of in-camera action in the cabin because it's going to be uh, pretty wet. Everything was organized very well. We were split into two different groups and one would leave earlier and go for the tour and the other would go for breakfast and then they would switch with each other. This not only allowed for adequate parking, but to make sure everybody could sit and have breakfast and not rush. Everyone on the Beaten Trail team stayed in one group and it worked out perfectly. It's a wonderful day, especially when your windshield wiper doesn't work. Maple, maple syrup run. And this is going here, out of the rain. 
what giant evaporator was to get 400 gallons an hour. Now with this, with the steam away on it, we can do the same gallons per hour. Our RO process is 1,800 gallons an hour. Everybody, how was the uh, very good sausage and pancakes? All good. Very good. Sear made. Awesome. Awesome. As you can see, we didn't like it. <laughs> That's a nice thick, fluffy one you got there. <laughs> Talking about the pancakes, right? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Of course, my windshield wiper decided not to work, so it was a bit sloppy going. We did get a chance to get out and see the actual taps in the trees and the maple syrup lines. This was most of the off-road trail time that we had throughout this day. It was educational and interesting to see all these lines. When Gary and I had been here earlier for the ATV regional trail, we did see these in the distance, and we could guess that they were something along the lines of maple syrup, but we didn't know. It was very cool to see the lines going from the trees to the storage location. We just went through the maple uh, syrup lines, and uh, a little bit of a uh, stop here. sugar so you got to take out the other 98 percent before we can get maple syrup. It was a good break to get out of the weather to see a little bit about how everything was done behind the scenes. Uh, yeah pretty much just uh, get everyone back in order and we're going to I think farm number three. On a cold and rainy day, the video footage doesn't look that great. I had a portable on a stick and a dry towel. Each stop had a little bit of an indoor tour and you could buy some syrup or candy and there were porta potties. At the last location there was hot food and it would have been good to have a few more of these but nothing like a warm pretzel to go on a rainy day. How's everybody doing? Wet. Wet and moist. Moist. Cold. Warm and dry. Yeah, I mean, it, I'm not really wet. It's not <laughs> miserable because I'm not, I'm just, it's a little cold, but uh, the heat is fine in there. Yeah. Just out here, it's cold. Not everybody had enclosures or heat or a heated seat. We did make sure we had our heated gloves and jacket, but we really didn't need to use it too much. It was very rainy. So we got a little bit of extra water to go through. You can introduce yourself and tell us, tell us a little bit about the event we just took part in. Hi, my name is Steve Kelly. I'm the president of the Potter County ATV Club. Um, today we had an event, it was called the Maple Syrup Ride. We went and visited uh, three farms, um, toured the maple process. They took us out in the woods, showed us how they tapped trees, how the lines ran packed the maple house, how they boiled it, cut it down into maple syrup. We ate pancakes and had some of their maple syrup. Yeah, it was great. It was great. It was uh, from, for somebody who's outside of the area, doesn't know what it takes. Uh, they were really helpful and it was very informative to know how syrup is graded and made and processed and all that. So it was good. I mean, the weather could have been better, but at least it was not ice. <laughs> right. And it, you know, it takes a lot more than one thinks to, you know, pour syrup on their pancakes. It, there's a lot of work involved and time. Uh, no, it was good. And so we had a, you had a hundred and how many? 120, 120 people 100, showed up. 120, 120 uh, two different groups to, you know, it's very organized very well. And so uh, we we'll definitely come up again. Uh, I know that you know, money raised uh, goes towards making sure that more of these events and rides and awareness in the state and anything else you want to and, tell and the viewers. With the money from the 50-50s and then proceeds from the merchandise that we sell, we have two certified youth safety instructors. Um, we have two four-wheelers from Polaris that we bought. We do youth, youth training. Um, 
keep watching. We'll be having one in April. Yeah, no, appreciate having us up. The, you know, hopefully we can join you guys with some other events. Thank yeah. you. Well, awesome. Great, nice great event. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> <laughs> that up, no, that doesn't. And in the morning, Gary whipped up some batter, and we had oh. sausage as oh, well as sorry. waffles and fresh waffles. maple syrup. Having some fun to eat, and then you're hitting the road? I'm worried about getting the, the, the mud off of my poorly chosen white shoes for the weekend. Yeah. Sorry, yeah, yeah. sorry you didn't realize you were. There's, uh, if anybody wants orange juice, just uh, take it. There's cranberry juice. Sure. Yeah. Well, we had a great time up here at the Potter County ATV Club Maple Syrup Run. Yeah, it was pretty, uh, pretty fun. And so, Miguel's nice enough to take me and Honda up and so we're able to have a little bit of time to you know get on the road and relax save me a little gas and everything so big thanks to everybody Gary and family for the cabin and allow us to stay here for the hospitality and everything and uh, yeah just everybody Miguel and Gary and Frank and Doc dad everybody to ride around up here it was a lot of fun it was a miserable rainy day we had a little bit of snow coming down this morning it's sunday and we're gonna head home overall a fun time big thanks again to our sponsor ride royal blue we appreciate them as well as all of our partners for being along for the ride be sure to get over to lid industries for the brightest rock lights you can find and check out some of our hats and shirts over at our merchandise page Thanks again for watching, and we hope to see you out there on the trail. Thanks. the key in it when you leave it. That's right. That's so you don't forget it. Why isn't it pink? Little Playboy Bonnie on it? Hey. You thought you're gonna get away with it too. You're all gonna be on camera. <laughs> yeah, we just edit all that <laughs> But that was you pissing there? Yeah. I was gonna say. Of course it was. I was with the, cam the camera on. Who else was gonna be pissing by that machine? <laughs> <laughs> you gotta mark your territory.